If you've noticed a lack in throttle response and want to gain some of that back without having to tune or modify your PCM, the CNL throttle controller will be a great addition to your 2007 to 2018 JK Wrangler. Now this will be an affordable way to reduce or modify the delay from when your foot hits the pedal to when your throttle body opens. And because the JK does have an electronic throttle body, you've probably felt that delay, especially if you've added any heavy armor or larger wheels and tires. Now this will gain some of that back while incorporating other features that will benefit you when it comes to fuel and security if those things are also a priority for you and your JK. This auto controller will feature multiple different modes, including eco, comfort, sport, race, normal, anti-skid, intelligent, and anti-theft modes. Now within each of those settings, you will be able to modify the sensitivity, perfect for the Jeep owner who's looking to fine tune their throttle response on the fly. Now getting into each of the modes, H1 will be your comfort mode, which balances performance and fuel economy. Now H2 will be your sport mode, and this will improve your engine response for better performance during daily commuting. Now H3 will be race, and this will offer maximum performance with immediate throttle response. Now EC, as you can imagine, will be your fuel economy, and this is your fuel efficient setting designed specifically for fuel savings. Now NOR is listed as normal, and this is going to set all of your acceleration back to the factory defaults. Now snow, or SNO, is your anti-skid, which is suitable for slippery conditions and reduces the tire spin by delaying the throttle response at initial acceleration. Now OOO is your intelligent mode, and this is going to map the acceleration automatically according to your normal driving habits. Now the last one, LOC or lock, is your anti-theft mode, which will eliminate the ability to drive altogether. The throttle pedal will have no response at all. Now this will come with, as you can see, a very low profile and sleek device where you can modify your responsiveness on the fly while also being very user friendly when it comes to dealing with the device and all the settings. Now you will have a small screen and two little buttons there to adjust the settings and the mode. Now this kit will also come with a plug and play wiring harness, making it super easy and a great way to switch up your throttle response when it comes to installing this on your JK. Now, I would like to mention though that this is not a tuner and it's only going to be changing your throttle response so no other parameters are going to be changed like you would when tuning your Jeep. Now this is going to cost you about $100, making this one of your most affordable options in the category for a throttle controller. Now other options may be just set up a little bit differently when it comes to the settings as well as the device itself. Now you'll see other options with Bluetooth compatibility with over 20 different settings, options that have sensitivity dials instead of preset settings, or choices that won't even have a switch or a dial, they may just have to be changed manually. Now I personally think that this is a great choice considering all of the different options, the adjustability, and the build of itself, making it well worth the $100. Now this will be a one out of three wrenches on the difficulty meter, taking you no longer than 20 minutes to get the job done. And at this point, we can head over to the shop and check out a detailed breakdown of the process and what it looks like to get this onto your JK at home. So that's going to wrap it up for me. Let's go ahead and get into it. Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to install our throttle controller here on our Wrangler. So let's get started. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to get underneath the dash and hook our throttle controller up. Now that's going to be underneath here, over, above, top of the gas pedal. We're just going to take that connector off, tie this in place, run our wire, mount our switch, and we'll be wrapping this up. So the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to reach my hand up inside here, and I'm going to find the connector right up here. Push it on the plug, and disconnect it like that. Next, what we'll do is take our throttle controller. I'm gonna get up inside here. It's a little tight. I'm gonna put one end on the controller. Like that, push down. And then the other end, I'm gonna reach up in here and find our other connector. And again, it's a little tight to get up in here. And I'll pull the other part of this connector. Now like that. Find our original connector. And tie these two into place. And now we'll run our wire. 
So now we have our controller hooked up. We're gonna run this wire. There's a couple different ways you can run it. Um, now in our Jeep, our, our whole panel here is broke. Um, but what I'm gonna do is just kind of pull this out of the way, drop it down, and I'm going to fish our wire through here. Try to get it to come up in here so I can get a hold of it. And if you can't get it up through, there's a couple different areas where it's kind of tight. What I'm gonna do is bring it up in place here for now because we're gonna be taking ours off. I'm gonna tuck the wires back up in here. They do give you some wire ties if you wanna run it. You wanna make sure that it's not touching any kind of uh, throttle pedal or anything when you hook this up. And I'm going to put this panel back in place. Like again, I said, our panel is kind of busted up here. It's missing some clips. I'm gonna end up having it come out right about there. And then we're gonna take our controller, peel off our double-sided tape here, plug this in. I'm gonna mount it right in place right there, and that's where it'll stay. So now I'm gonna go through the modes with you. As you can see right now, we're in normal mode. This is anti-skid mode. This is intelligent mode. This is anti-theft mode. Now we're gonna to go to H1, which is comfort mode. And you're gonna be able to adjust your settings from one, from zero, I think from one to nine. Nine being the more sensitive, where one is just more easy. And you're gonna be able to do that and set it. And then when it gets to nine, it goes right back to one. And then you're also gonna have sport mode, race mode, economy mode, and back to normal mode. And again, when you're in the, op the other modes, you're going to actually be able to adjust your setting with your adjust number from one to nine. That wraps up this review and install of our CNL throttle controller for 0718 Jeep Wrangler JKs. Thanks for watching, and for all things Wrangler, keep it right here at extremeterrain.com.